health service BI is often defined as an approach that enables business users, so important thing, not just data teams, right, to explore, vis explore and visualize and analyze information on their own. So the main goal is, you know, giving people across the organizations the ability to answer their own data questions and make uh, the decisions faster. Now, in 2025, the self-service BI still comes with the major challenges. The market itself is booming, it's booming. It's growing nearly 90% per year, yet only about one third of companies say that self-service BI initiatives are truly successful. So the biggest obstacle isn't technology, it's actually governance. Because according to Bark's survey, 73% of companies cite that lack of semantic layer and metric consistency is the top barrier to scaling the self-service BI. So in other words, people can build dashboards, but they can always trust the revenue or the margin means that the same thing across departments. So Mark, uh, maybe one question for you. Uh, I'm sure you have some insights from working with users on a daily basis. Um, how do they actually typically address this in 2025? Yeah, so when we're talking to users, uh, we see that a lot of people are still struggling with this. How to best organize the data layer and the semantic layer and me metrics, how to basically uh, create a flexible data model to enable this uh, self-service BI. And then because self-service BI is such a wide topic and there's so many different approaches, so it also depends on the uh, maturity of the company and the, the, the business users, whether or not they are uh, proficient enough with the BI tools to, to even like support themselves. Um, it depends, right? So it's never one answer and never one model to approach self-service BI. Uh, 